Hello, you know this is the original QF7, Queen Esther, with Queen Esther Speaks Show on TalkTainmentRadio.com, as well as TMI, Talking More Intimately, where there's no such thing as too much information when we're talking more intimately, and that's exactly what we're doing today. We are talking more intimately with the wonderful 2012 delegates of the Miss Plus America pageant. In fact, I believe we have a couple delegates that we're going to tune into right now and talk to them about various questions and various things things that are going on in their lives. Look who's coming up right now. Hi there, how are you? Hi. What's your name? I'm Lexi Lehrman. Lexi Lehrman, and who are you? Who are you with the Miss Plus America pageant? I am the Miss Teen Plus Ambassador from Miami Beach, Florida. Miami Beach, Florida, that's all you need in your life, right? Is a beach, Florida. What made you compete in the Miss Plus America pageant? Well, I will give credit where credit is due, but the movie Miss Congeniality. I mean, I saw the sisterhood and all the fun they were having and thought I would love that experience. That is awesome. So tell me more about this teen thing because there's some teens that are competing for a title and it's what, the Miss Plus America 2012 Teen Ambassador? Is that yes, correct? Okay, so what does it really take to be a teen ambassador for the Miss Plus America pageant? In my belief, I think you have to be kind, courteous, and a generous person. Okay, kind. What was it else? Courteous. Okay. Now, do you think teens, do they represent that, those qualities? Unfortunately, not all teens do, but in my heart, everyone has some goodness inside of them. I love that. Okay, well, I got one more question for you. What if you get crowned as the teen ambassador this year, what do you want to accomplish? What do you want to do over the next year? I really would love to spread the word about breast cancer because that is my platform. Breast cancer is a terrible disease that affects many, many women and men around the country and my father's side and my mother's side. So, so you have a personal family history with it? Okay, well that is that is definitely commendable. I am a, I'm a, it's amazing. Now, I actually do have one more question and it's because I witnessed this young lady on stage tonight as she competed in the preliminary competition and she actually had a question that she was able to write for herself and answer on stage and I don't remember the question so I'm going to ask you to repeat the question and the answer that you gave and I think it does tie back to your platform, correct? It does. My question was, what was your last birthday present? And my answer was, I probably a Barbie because the last birthday present I got was when I was eight years old because instead of presents every year, my friends and family donate to Susan G. Komen to fight against breast cancer. Okay, see, so you're getting ready to make me cry. So before we do, before Queen Esther sheds a tear, I'm going to say thank you so much. I'm going to give her a great MP hug and bid farewell to all of you. Thank you. All right, and that's more of Talking More Intimately. See, we're going deep now.